All right, guys, here we are for the start of our Harry Potter or Hogwarts Legacy playthrough. Hope you're excited. I'm very excited for this. Um, we're actually giving this another go because I uh, originally got this on PC, but it ran like crap. So now I redownload or downloaded it on PS5. Hopefully it plays a little better. Um, so we're going to do a new character this time. I don't even know what I want to look like. Him? Should we do him? Face? Oh, he's all freckly. I don't want a freckly face. Looks gross. Yeah, let's do you. Face is fine. Um, we're going to put some glasses on. We'll be white. Um, what should we do for the hair? These are all, they're not all girl hairs down here. I mean, I kind of like this one. Do this and change the hair color. Ooh. I like white hair. We'll do white hair. Don't need a scar. Complexion, what is this? No complexion. Eye color. Where's white? Or can we do black? I like that. Eyebrow color. Is there a white one? Am I on this side? Yeah, we'll do white. Uh, eyebrows are fine. I don't need to do any more than that. Voice one. That was quite something. I am indeed a student, but I... No. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. It was wonderful. I... That was quite something. I am indeed a student, but I could... A few cobwebs and some... Du I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Yeah, those it was just wonderful. sound so weird. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. Okay, first name. How do we capitalize? L2. KC. Ugh. Casey Rasputin. And I'm a wizard. Start your journey. All right, we're gonna start the old journey. Ah, it appears we are almost ready to depart. Yeah, this game it's already runs a bit more better than on spell casting. my PC. I presume you've been practicing the spells we worked on. I have, Professor. Perfect. Well, I'm quite sure I've never seen anyone take so quickly to a second-hand wand. You'll be a force to be reckoned with when you get your own. Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate you working with me before the time begins. So I only played like two hours on the George. PC, so I didn't get far. Rather cryptic description of our location did not I know what like happens on the first I've day and all that more stuff. vaguely to find destination than this. <laughs> Though I confess I may have miscalculated slightly on my first try. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some theater goers in the West End. <laughs> it's been much too long. When I received your owl, I must uh, say I best not speak here, Eliazar. Hmm? Oh, Eliazar? Course. Why don't we speak en route to Hogwarts? We have a start of term feast and a sorting ceremony to get to. Wonderful idea. As long as your young charge here doesn't mind me tagging along. Not at all, sir. After you. More than welcome to come Ages along. Ages since I've been to the castle. Would be good to see the old pile of rocks. Okay. 
could that be? Sound better? Is this better? No idea. Hopefully the gameplay audio isn't too quiet or too loud. KC. Yes, sir. I'm starting school as a fifth year. How extraordinary. It is indeed. None of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to Hogwarts so late. Nor have I. Of course, as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years now, the headmaster asked if I could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term begins. Well, you couldn't have asked for a better mentor. Professor Fig is not only an exceptional teacher, he's also a remarkably intuitive and gifted wizard. Mr. Osric is prone to flattery. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the Ministry. <laughs> Why is that window so goddamn bright? Have you seen this? They're like flying next to the sun? I have. Opinions differ as to how great a threat Ranrock really is. Although I've yet to convince my colleagues at the Ministry, I believe he is a significant threat. And it was your wife, Eleazar, who alerted me to his activities months ago. Miriam? Miriam? Oh. <sighs> she wrote to me about Ranrock before she died, wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Before I could respond, I... Received this. Yes, it's the thing we can it open. Was the last thing she sent me, Eleazar. It came to me via her owl. But with no correspondence, I can only assume that she had to get rid of it quickly to keep it safe. Presumably from Ranrock. I cannot open it. Whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed. It looks like goblin metal. That symbol. What's that glow? I don't see a glow. The glow right there. Do I? Merlin's beard. How did you wait? We did. Yeah, don't touch the port key. Oh no. This is a good opening to a game though. Very unexpected. Very, very. Ekio. He did that without a wand. Are you all right? Quite all right. Thanks you for asking. Hurt. Perhaps a bit. Take this. It's Wigan Weld potion. That stuff will write you in a second. Back to normal. What happened? Poor George. I can't believe he... What the hell got into that damn thing? Attacking a carriage mid-air? A typical dragon would never... Professor? <sighs> Sir, where are we? I'm not sure. 
But that key you discovered was clearly a port key. Port key? An item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. Yeah, how do you not know what a port key is? I'm feeling better, sir, if you'd like to look around a bit. I would. But stay close. We've no idea who created this port key. Or why. Yes, I'm so happy this runs so much better than on my PC. This is perfect. How far did that port key take us? Farther from London than the carriage traveled. We're somewhere in the Scottish Highlands. Sir, those ruins. Do you the think- The port key was meant to lead us there. I do. This has not been the day either of us expected. But Miriam sent that port key to George for a reason. And I believe that she, and now George, died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. Look at those seagulls. If you're sure you're all right and wouldn't mind indulging me, I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. Let's see if we can find a path, however faded it may be. Mind your step. You mind your step. You watch the fuck out. Where do you suppose your wife got the port key that brought us here? A good question. Miriam spent years searching for evidence of a long forgotten form of ancient magic. Ancient magic? Yes. A powerful magic wielded by a rare few that seems to have been lost to time. Hogwarts Castle was built by, and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. I don't know where she came into possession of the port key, but I am certain it was to do with that search. Ah, there's the path down below. This way. Yes, this way. <laughs> but sir, <laughs> don't grunt so loud. For evidence of lost magic. Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding world. Spoke of the good it could do. But magic is no different than any power. What really matters is the one who wields it. Can I shoot this with my wand now? Is that ice? It's not cold enough here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's see some of that wand work you were practicing. Focus on the center. Boom. How's that, buddy? How's that big boy, Fig? Whoa. That was a bit rougher than I'd expected. Come on, hurry up. We got places to be. We got to get to Hogwarts. Uh. Ah, up there. Yep. There's a chest over here, though. Got to go grab this. Get those 30 gold coins. We're close now. It's just ahead. Steady yourself. Reparo. Yep, here we are. Why would someone have built this here? I suspect they valued their privacy. That port key led us here for Why a didn't reason. the port key just take Let's us right here? That Anything makes no that sense. Seems 
out of place. This wall looks out of place. Professor, Investigate. It's a mural of some kind. Mm, perhaps our host was a noted seer. Interesting. Professor, who do we got statue? here? This may have been his home. Okay. Well, let's go around. <laughs> that enchanted crystallized stone again. But what could it what's this? Professor Fig. Look at that. Well, you can see them in the reflection. It's next gen oh, gaming right there. Why would someone have conjured that enchanted stone here? And how is there a room behind it? What room? I don't see anything. There's that glow again, like the glow on the port key container. Interact. Let's go right through. What in Merlin's name? <clears throat> Godric's heart. We're in Gringotts. Where are we? Gringotts. I don't believe it. Come on, it's Gringotts, clearly. Hello? Wake up the little goblin boy. No, it can. It's me. Uh, just a moment. <laughs> <Ooh. clears throat> uh, here. <clears throat> Welcome to Gringotts Wizarding Bank. Vault number 12, I presume. Yep, that's the one. <clears throat> Precisely. The key? Mm hmm? Your wife's port key. Oh, yes, of course. This way, then. Stay close. You stay close to me. After you. Off we go. Vault 12, here we come. How many vaults are there in Green Vaults? Hundreds. In fact, you'll see quite a few on our way to Vault number 12. As we speak, we're just beneath the main lobby. The vaults you see now are the newest. Are private entrances to the bank common at Green Vaults? They are most uncommon. Only one with great wealth or power, or both, could have arranged for such a service. You want to take a breath? A what? A breath. That waterfall washes away all enchantments. It's a security measure. Experienced the thief's downfall before, have you? Heard of it? These are the lower vaults that we're passing now. How deep are we going? Vault number 12 was commissioned shortly after Gringotts was founded over four centuries ago. It resides in the deepest part of the bank. Where's Harry Potter's Seven, vault? With quite a distance to go. That's the vault I want to visit. <clears throat> Here's this shady character. It's his red armband. Number. Vault 12. 
Momentous day. <laughs> hmm. On your way. Professor. The red armband, it's glowing. of the bank. Rare anyone goes there anymore. Ah, okay. Here we, Here we are. are. Vault 12. When was the last time this vault was accessed? A goblin has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years. In that time, no one has visited Vault 12 until today. Vault 12, thank you for your help. In we go. What do you suppose we should be looking for? I'm Probably sure. the thing at the end of the hallway. So, I wonder if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Wait. Best of luck. <sighs> Professor? was certainly unexpected. Let me think. There must be something here. Hmm. Revelio, perhaps. Revelio? Yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus. Easy. Revelio. There, I saw something. Move a bit closer and try again. Revelio. A door. Well, that's a start. There's that symbol again. I don't suppose you see a way to. I do, Professor. That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw on the pool key container. If what you can see reveals the way forward. Then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. Don't mind if I do. Lumos. This is no ordinary vault. I suspect we will need to earn our way out of here. What do you mean, earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I do. But to what end, I can't say. Stay close. There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Revelio, not out of Gringotts. Is there any good stuff hiding around here? Well, my hair's like glowing. That looks so cool. I see something up ahead. What is it? That glow again. But on the floor. Over here, Fig. Right here. Lumos. What happened? When I moved towards the glow, it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Are you all right? Yes, sir. I'm fine. You seem to have caused the floor to change. That statue? What statue? I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Revelio, I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. It is. Very true. The reflection's still yeah. there. 
but the statue's positions don't match. Wait. Now it's rotating. When moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm. Perhaps you should cast Lumos. Yeah. New spell. Lumos. Well done. Now the reflection is turning towards me. It does follow the light. Time to fight some statues. Look out! Protego. Protego. More counter, come on. Who wants some? Oh, God, didn't see that one. Who else? I can do Lumos too. Hey. Professor Fig. Professor, there's a chest over here. This isn't good. Where am I supposed to go? This way, What's duh. happening? The wisps of magic seem to be leading me somewhere. Another chest out here. Ah, that's where they're leading me. That glow again. I suppose I'm on my own this time. There is one. Here's two. Where's the third one at? Here my boy is. Yeah, I already did stupefy. Who wants to attack me? Come on. Stupefy, stupefy, stupefy. Stupefy. One more. Stupefy. Wish I was getting XP for this. That would be nice. Stupefy. Is that all of them? Sprint. Now what do we got over here? Oh. This is where we get the pensive? Yeah. There you are. 
No, there How you are. You... What is this place? I don't know. But I found this floating above that basin. That is no mere basin. That is a pensive for viewing memories. I wonder. Follow my lead. Dumbledore wannabe. All is in place. The portkey is well hidden. Perhaps too well. Charles Rockwood. I wonder if the path we've created may be impossible to follow. It will only be impossible for one who cannot see traces of ancient magic. Percival or Rackham. Your ability to see what others cannot will not be enough, Percival. We are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets, with knowledge others will do. Is Dumbledore's like middle tell. name Percival? Yes. Whose name is Percival? If we are correct, Charles. The witch or wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge and the responsibility that accompanies it. We've done all that we can. That's what you're seeing. The glow that surrounded them. Yes, sir. Ancient magic. Astonishing. Can I see magic? Just ancient magic. Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed, but could never. Miriam, and perhaps George, died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. And you, it seems, are the key to understanding why. We were all looked rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's coming. Uh-oh. Who were they? I don't know. Ranrock. But, sir, you shouldn't be in there. I was right. Ranrock. Seems my reputation precedes me. I was beginning to think... Got some you long arms the there, boy. Rackham's vault. And why are you here? No need for that. Just... Give me whatever it is you found here, and we can let bygones be bygones. <coughs> uh, sir, they had the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I, I only meant that the instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must insist. I was to grant access only to one with the key, and you did Boom, Dad. Nice. Very nice. I have no patience for traitors. Now, where were we? I'm not giving you anything. Hmm. Well, perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful. <laughs> Time to escape. What is that golem thing anyways? What is that?
Made it to Hogwarts. Are you all right? Fine, sir. I've never seen so powerful a goblin. He seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. Where are we? <laughs> it can't be. It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to. Here it is. The money shot. Time for the sorting ceremony. Oh, good. We haven't missed the sorting ceremony. I'm no expert, but that seems more appropriate. Now, I Much need to better. study this locket as soon as I can, but first I must contact the Ministry. They need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock. For the moment, I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me. Of course, sir. Thank you. Ready for the sorting ceremony? Wait, bring the hat back. We're not done yet. We got one more. One more. Phineas Nigellus Black. Black. Prepare yourself. See related to Sirius? The headmaster. Fig, nice of you to join us. The sorting ceremony is over. There were complications. Complications? It seems the goblin Enough. problem has. Goblins. I've no time for rumors, Fig, and I'm rapidly losing whatever patience I had left. If you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. <clears throat> I'll be in touch. Yeah, you will. Professor Weasley, we've one more to be sorted. Welcome. You're just in time. Have a seat. Yeah, toss that hat on me. Let's see where I end up. Ah, yes. A bit older than the others, aren't you? You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations. Can't wait I'm to explore. To exploring Hogwarts and the world beyond the castle and grounds. Mm. Indeed. Much can be gleaned by having an adventurous spirit. But your professors have a great deal to teach you as well. Mm. I wonder. I detect something in you. A certain sense of... Mm, what is it? 
curiosity. I, I do enjoy a good puzzle, and I believe I have a ready mind. Mm. You're clever indeed. Extremely. You have the ability to reflect clearly on that which puzzles others. And you've a ready mind, quick to learn. Perhaps you belong in Ravenclaw. Yeah, I do. We'll accept this house. You belong in Ravenclaw. What was that? And one more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. Boo. Come on. Enough. That's a cheap cop it's out. Not as though I've banned flying Just so you didn't altogether. have to put Quidditch into but the game. Don't tempt me. You are here to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I said, I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. Yep, yep. Quite an entrance. It's lovely to meet you. I'm... Professor Weasley, would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As Deputy Headmistress, it is my distinct honor to show you to your common room. Right this way. It's quite uncommon for a student to begin as a fifth year. Might be a bit of a challenge, but one I'm sure you're up for. I am, Professor. This is the entrance to the Ravenclaw common room. You must solve a riddle to enter. I won't be of much help, I'm afraid. This sort of thing has always confounded me. I have no idea what the answer to this riddle is either. I don't understand it. Who lived longer? The ghost? Or the poltergeist? A ghost the or ghost. A poltergeist? Hmm. A non-being can never have been. Like, how is that the answer? I don't understand that one bit. Well done. Now, go on in and get some sleep. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. Time for some classes. Looks like everyone's gone. Welcome Let's to Hogwarts. To 